Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here and in this video we're going to do a camera comparison of two dual camera smartphones from Xiaomi in India. The Xiaomi Mi A1 with the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. So these are two dual camera smartphones and in this video we'll do a camera comparison in different light conditions. So first step, let's have a look at the camera on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. It comes with a uh, dual camera, 12 megapixel primary camera, 5 megapixel secondary camera, S top 2.2, LED flash and on the front panel we have a 20 megapixel selfie camera again with an LED flash. So that's the camera on the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. Now coming to the Xiaomi uh, Mi A1, it comes with a dual 12 megapixel camera, f-stop 2.2 aperture, uh, 2x optical zoom uh, for the secondary camera and uh, we have dual LED flash and a 5 megapixel front facing camera with a 1080p resolution. So that was the camera on the Mi A1. Now let's have a look at uh, the camera samples taken with these two devices. First up, let's have a look at the video recording. So this is the 1080p sample taken from both the devices. Uh, you can see that electronic image stabilization on the Redmi Note 5 Pro works really well and uh, it uh, is able to stabilize the video. On the other hand, the Mi A1 was, uh, uh, video was shaky, but uh, Overall, we feel the colors were slightly better on the Mi A1 uh, when compared to the Redmi Note 5 Pro. Uh, the Mi A1 also had the advantage that it has 4K recording, but that is not available right now on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. But uh, overall, for the EIS feature and overall good clarity, we will still give it to the Redmi Note 5 Pro in terms of the VD recording. Next step, let's have a look at the daylight captures. So this is one of the toughest comparisons we have done uh, in the recent times. And you can see that the, both the devices uh, did a really good job in terms of the daylight conditions. And uh, overall, uh, it produces some really good results in daylight conditions. So both these devices are really good. But we feel the colors were a tad better on the Mi A1 and also the sharpness levels. And uh, But uh, overall detailing was really good on both the phones. The Redmi Note 5 Pro is probably the first uh, Redmi series uh, smartphones with really great cameras. Camera. So in terms of the daylight conditions, we feel both these devices did a really good job, but the Mi even was uh, a tad better in terms of the color reproduction and also uh, sharpness levels. So that's by only by a very small margin. So these were the daylight captures. Now next step, let's have a look at the close-up images. So here again, we feel uh, both these devices were neck to neck in terms of the uh, color quality, sharpness levels. And here again, uh, we feel uh, the Mi A1 was a tad uh, sharper in terms of the overall imaging uh, clarity, but details were available on both the phones. So it's really tough to predict uh, one uh, camera out of these two devices in terms of the daylight conditions. Both were really good and two of the best camera smartphones below the 15K price segment in India right now. So these are some of the samples we have taken uh, from both these devices. Next step, let's have a look at the portrait samples taken from these two devices. And here we feel both these devices did a decent job overall. Uh, the Mi even has a slight advantage here again uh, with the portrait samples. Uh, but overall, we feel uh, the Redmi Note 5 Pro also was quite good in terms of the portrait photography. And the final aspect is the uh, low light sample. So here again, we feel uh, both were neck to neck in terms of uh, uh, the low light uh, uh, clarity and both did a really good job to the good uh, camera smartphones with low light performance here again we feel the mi a1 was a tad better in terms of the overall clarity and sharpness levels but the redmi note 5 pro was uh, almost uh, closer uh, to the mi a1 in terms of the overall results so both these devices are neck to neck in terms of the camera the rear camera but uh, the mi a1 has a slight advantage uh, with respect to the color reproduction and also the sharpness levels now finally, the selfie experience. So this is one area where the Redmi Note 5 Pro wins hands down when compared to the Mi A1. The 5 megapixel shoot on the Mi A1 was kind of pretty much average. But uh, the Redmi Note 5 Pro is definitely one of the good selfie cameras out there. Uh, excellent uh, clarity, good detailing, good skin tones and the bokeh mode was uh, neatly implemented. And you can see the edges uh, uh, were really good and the edge detection is uh, simply accurate on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. So the selfie camera, the obvious choice is the Redmi Note. 5 Pro. So that was a detailed camera comparison of these two devices. So which is the better camera out there? So it's a really tough uh, job to decide one camera. We feel the rear camera, the Mi A1 has a slight edge in terms of the color reproduction and the sharpness levels, but only by a very small margin. And uh, the video recording was uh, our choice was the Redmi Note 5 Pro and the selfie experience also was better on the Redmi Note 5 Pro. So in terms of the overall uh, aspects, we feel the Redmi Note 5 Pro is our choice. Why we would say because uh, even though the Mi A1 has an advantage in terms of the rear camera, the selfie uh, uh, photos 
were much better on the Redmi Note 5 Pro and the video recording has EIS although there is no 4K support. So overall as a camera package both considering the both uh, the front and the rear camera we feel the Redmi Note 5 Pro is our pick in this camera comparison. So that's all guys with uh, the camera comparison of the Redmi Note 5 Pro and the Mi A1. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit that subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.